What's going on? You guys. I am literally chilling. Meditating. Going within. Today is money manifestation. I got a lot of healing going on. All three of my phones is off. Literally cut off. Not on do not disturb nothing. I'm not getting anything. Don't know what's going on right now. Out in the world. Um honestly, I really don't give a fuck <laughs> what's going on out in the world right now. Um, because I gotta focus on me and healing me completely and focusing on me. And just wanna deal with my energy. Like everything is just no go but set breathing. That's gonna get done. But right now, everything is just like, I'm at a halt. I just want to relax. But anyway, I'm going to also have me a shot. You feel me? It, ain't gonna, it can't hurt me. Gossip about it, whatever. Hey, you know, it doesn't matter. But anyway, I haven't opened this yet. You feel what I'm saying? This is Tennessee. This was a birthday gift. You open this. And here we go. This. You can't get anywhere. This is one of a kind. You feel what I'm saying? I don't even know what, what this is at the bottom. Uh-uh. What is that? Hmm, let's see. You know you don't take this out of here. It's a way to get this out of here without... Let me turn the light, y'all. I want to make sure what I'm doing right. I don't like ripping stuff. Y'all already know. I don't like ripping stuff, so... I don't know how this come out, but I know it's got to be a pull. It's on something. I know y'all see me like she's trying to get that handy out. Yeah, I am. <laughs> yeah, I am. I deserve it. Everybody been irking my soul. And I'm sitting here cooking me a nice meal. It's kind of like a Dominican dish. It's my favorite. Like the little sweet potatoes, the rice, the peas, the carrots, baked chicken, smothered in with um, stuff in the ham on cornbread. I just want to be left alone. I don't want to hear shit from nobody. <laughs> like for real. It's like real fucked up, but I don't want to hear shit from nobody. So like, I just don't. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. It could even be a death. I hear that shit after Monday. Hit me up. Leave a message. My inbox on my Facebook, I got fucked. Like, fuck. Whereas, though, certain people can't send me no message. Why? Because I don't want to hear nothing. <laughs> so, and then others ain't blocked because they're not going to call me on no bullshit because they know what's going on. They already know. So, they laughing with me. But the other ones that want to call me and tell me, shit, I don't want to hear that shit right now. I'm trying to focus on getting this out. So, like, because I don't, I'm trying to, and it can't be that way. That's, I know this can't come all the way off like that, can it? No, no. It ain't going like I want. I'm trying. Because the person that did this, that created this, trust me, they made it a way where you don't got to rip it. Because they know people like to keep shit. I think I see. Ah, wait, 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 y'all. Hold up. I think I see a little bit how to get this out. Now y'all see my cat She's scratching on like the It's a way to get this out I'm just not seeing it It's a way I'm gonna get this motherfucker out Cause it gotta be It got this way in there But neither one is getting it out That's crazy I'm trying to get this honey out <laughs> I know y'all laughing like, yo, she really trying to get that. <laughs> I got it. Yeah. <laughs> yo, I went crazy to get it out. Now, I want to know what is this. This is a, a, a oyster they gave you. Uh, uh, not an oyster. Uh, it's something that they giving me. I'll tell you what, whoever made this. Oh, it come right out. Look at that shit. Ain't that nice? Look at that. Ain't that nice? Okay, but it's not all that. 
Oh, that was so nice. This person know who they are. Matter of fact, I'm kind of waiting for them. I know I want to be left alone, but this person is loud in my energy. Because they don't be on no bullshit. But, okay, that is nice. All right. Y'all see? Yeah, so I'm going to give a shot. Forgot good wine and just turn. You got to do some work. <laughs> Yo, that shit crazy. I was going nuts trying to get this shit open. I got to start wearing my glasses. Let me put them on right now because <laughs> I can't even see. I don't want to cut myself. I know my Capricorns like all signs really like, well, damn, I could see clear. I need to wear my glasses. That shit deep. I keep saying it and don't wear them. I need to stop rushing and take my time because everything is right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. I don't want that much at all because I really don't want to drink, but I just want something in me while I'm doing, so I'm doing my Zaza. You feel what I'm saying? This is to all the fallen soldiers. This is to my nigga rat, my best friend, my partner, my love, my life, my loyal friend. It's never, I'm never going to find a guy like this one again. No matter what people had to say about that nigga, Jamel Kwan, he ain't never crossed me, yo. He saved me from a lot of shit, real shit. Other than that, yo, rest in peace to my goddaughter, yo. I know you up there laughing about all the shit that's going on right now. Hey, it is what it is, goddaughter. I love you, yo. And I'm always going to love you. I fucks with none of them bitches at the end of the day. Bottom fucking line. This is to my goddaughter. What's good, guys? As for me, I'm cooling. I'm laughing. It's been a lot going on, y'all. Not, I mean, not in my circle, you feel me? I can't even say in my circle, just outside of my circle. It's not really touching me. I'm just laughing. It's been so crazy. And it's like the close of the ending of the cycle. I don't know if you know what I mean, but like the close of the end of the cycle you feel is near. And like you feel it and you just know it's near. Every time I'm up to this, right, my cat come over here. I lost the whole, I don't even going to tell you what I lost. Come to find out my cat was on something. But anyway, back to the conversation at hand yeah you guys i am chilling you know maintaining and i'm on meditation mode and people probably like well what's meditation mode to you no phone like i know i'm on social media doing my little read whatever that's different but i'm not accepting no text no calls no nothing like the phones is off all three of them voicemail people getting whatever they getting i don't fucking know and i'm not cutting them on to Monday night or Tuesday early morning. Real shit. I'm just not beat. I don't care what's going on. I'll find out after the fact. Death. <laughs> jail. Money. All that. I'm good. I check my emails. Yes. But everything else is nothing I want to talk about. And nothing I want to say. And I need a rest. So that's what I'm doing. And I'm chilling. So, this is going to be the last read until probably maybe Tuesday for me. I'm going on a full meditation. I just couldn't do one right full right now because I have a reading left. I know what I'm doing. And then, um, y'all be hearing from me early this week. I'm just thinking and just relaxing. Cooking me a good dinner. You feel what I'm saying? Like, mm-mm. Couple days. Made sure I made enough just for a couple days. At least by the time trash day go out. But I'm just sitting and relaxing in my energy, yo. Unbothered. 
I gotta make money even in my sleep. I don't know what others doing, but that's one of them bum bitches. Masculine, feminine energy. Because you got these niggas have bitch too. You feel me? A lot of them looking for beds. Not the fuck here. I need thousands for motherfuckers to live up in this house. You gotta be paying everything. I had a boyfriend that was a real boyfriend. I didn't have to spend no money. Uh-uh. They paid the bills. That's what a man's supposed to do. And I took care of what I need to do. So, therefore, I'm not slacking myself with nothing. You ain't right. You don't even need to come to me. Because I ain't beat. <laughs> Shit. Well, if you selfish and all that, I don't, I don't feel like dealing with that. You gotta go get you a bum bitch. They around. They suck, fuck, lick, all that for free. Take care of grown ass men, all that. I ain't with it. If you ain't doing better than my son, you may try to trick me at the beginning or whatever you up to. Even in my own business, I don't fuck around. You gotta go. I'm not having no stagnant energy around me, yo. I'm about to go under hibernation to next year anyway. Which is real close, but for others it ain't. I'm about to go and do what I need to be doing. So, I'll be missing unless somebody see my social media. Other than that, I'm, mm -mm. I got shit going on. I ain't got time to keep playing. And I want to relax. I got some things to take care of. These girls be around here chasing these guys. I don't be trying to chase nobody. I don't chase. I have a place. I don't chase at all. Once you give me that vibe and I feel that vibe, I'll be out. I'm too pretty for that. I ain't mean, look at shit. I ain't insecure. No way. At all. Mm -mm. So, therefore, some guys need insecure bitches. I'm not. So, you can't run and you can't play me. Harry, at all. Even in a partnership. Once I find out the real you, you gotta go. I don't fuck with you no more. For real, I don't fuck around. I don't fuck with snakes. Why? Why should I fuck with a snake? You snake. You a snake. The fuck you wanna be around me for? To try to snake me again? Get the fuck out of here. I don't fuck with you. Or your dick between your legs type energy. No. Bitch female energy. These men is crazy. So, yeah. We gonna see what's the energy of what's going on. You feel what I'm saying, my caps? Capricorn in the motherfucking building. We gonna see what's the energy surrounding Capricorns. You feel what I'm saying? Because we, we got too much hate going on right now. <laughs> Yo, them bitches is around. Niggas too. They stalking. Whatever. I don't know. I don't give a fuck what they doing. I'm single as fuck. I let everybody know what it is. In my life, you don't help somebody that can't help their self. Motherfuckers need to learn to help their self and stop having pity parties all day. It's always a pity party. Like, nobody want to hear that shit. Grown-ass men, grown-ass women. Especially grown-ass men. Like, come on, man. You've been having a pity party for years. It's time, to, it's time to man up and get your life together. Keep telling people, when you're 30, I will really say 28. There should be something going on or you know which direction your ass is going to. Or if you don't know what direction, you stable enough where you don't got to worry about all that. Bottom fucking line. I don't know what people are doing. I just snippity snip motherfuckers. Bottom line. Yeah, somebody is coming up out of having quality time. Maybe with you, or you thinking about quality time with somebody here. Could be. Capricorn. Me, I, I think about it, but <laughs> that's about it. Because I can't be laying up with somebody that's not doing nothing for their self, really, and they all want, they, they worry about everything else, and they trying to con everybody. I ain't, you can't con me, and you can't get me for no money. If anything, I'm getting you for everything, like I do. 
I don't fuck around. So right now, somebody is coming up out of have a quality time. Somebody on your mind or somebody, you on somebody's mind. And in their mind, they like, damn, no quality time. Oh, damn. I meant to hit this for that evil. Only spiritual people know what that's about. So, yeah. I definitely see. I mean, this did fall kind of, I would say past energy. Yeah, you're coming up out of close of some type of cycle. You need to close a cycle. You're thinking about somebody. Or somebody thinking about you being a partner in crime and it's like you it's a lot of confusion around you or you're confused or somebody's confused here you come up out of letting somebody come in your blind soft spot so i'm seeing maybe you you open your eyes to to some type of situation here i'm gonna clear this energy up But it's some type of cycle that it seems like that needs to close here, Capricorn. And you're not trying to close it. And the energy I'm getting, if you don't close it, it's about to close anyway. And it's going to close the way you ain't going to like. So, I mean, you could take what resonate, but you know how God moves with his cycle. I'm going to have to stop it a little bit because I have baked chicken in the oven. And I need to watch my shit. I'm a cooker. See, if bitches focus on doing something in the kitchen... They will be so great. Is this enough? Yep, that's enough. I'll be right back. Yeah. That wasn't going to be fast. I mean, I didn't even have to use this because I had clothes. I don't know why I did. Um, yeah. At the bottom of the deck, I'm seeing somebody is like in between having peace. It's like, could be the way I put the cards down. I don't feel that though. I just feel like somebody is trying to have peace. They in between peace. They in between the truth and lies. I don't know. It's just a lot going on. Yeah, I see it was a tower moment in somebody's life. Sagittarius energy, you started from the bottom, worked your way up top. You took some type of chance here. And I think it took you to a tower moment here. Capricorn. Let's talk about this shit. Yeah, coming across you again. It's like somebody is focusing on money or your money. Or you're thinking about money here. Yeah. Somebody is a somebody could be being real slick here with the death card here. Press somebody could think about like even harming you here. Scorpion energy. You may not have your guard up for some type of manipulation here. And somebody could have a, a, a victory over a situation here. Somebody could be stealing, lying. Yeah, a painful ending. Hmm. Let's go get a complete spread and put this back with that energy. I don't want to use those cards. I'm going to use these cards. See what energy come out of them. Because that energy coming out of them other cards was deep already. I didn't even get it in the reading like deep like that. So I don't like that. Let's just see. If it's still deep, then hey, it is what it is. Holy Spirits, my ancestors, Big Michael, please open the door so I can see everything I need to see for the sign of Capricorns, for the sign of Capricorns. I ask you to protect me from all evil. 
all third eye and reverse this shit back to them. It's like, I'm feeling like something is around me, kind of. Capricorns. I'm a Capricorn, so I definitely want to know what's going on. I'm just glad I feel relieved in some way because I really want something forward and it's going the way I want because I'm not beat for certain shit. I will leave you in a heartbeat. Masculine, feminine energy. I don't play that shit. I don't take chances like I do. It take one time or one little intuition and I'm too, too, too. Sometimes it take a little more time than that because i would tiptoe around especially if i'm getting something out the deal or something going on with it that suits me always know see what people don't understand about me is i do shit to suit me not you so anything i do is a reason behind why i did it it could be arguing fighting sleeping with somebody not fucking with somebody Having a new friend. Everything for me is something wrapped around it. And you can never figure me out. So people, stop. Stop. You can't figure me out. You don't know me. Especially if you start knowing me like just now or in my 20s. You didn't know me. Who know me is passed away. <laughs> what the fuck? Besides others that just don't even indulge in drama. They don't want to feel that they got their own shit going on. But I'm saying somebody is leaving somebody behind, definitely. Somebody is going to karma waters. Definitely their emotions intact here. Somebody could be thinking about you from the past. But I I don't you didn't come out here, but it's a lot of emotion here and truth here. You come up out of have a strength maybe for a Sagittarius here. You're using your intuition, period. That is the overall energy. You're using your intuition. You could be pregnant here. You're just chilling. Somebody's trying to come towards you and offer you something. But it's like nothing going to bring, it's not going to bring you nothing but a painful end. It looked like this already happened and you move forward here. Because they have nothing to offer you. You can't build nothing. You can't work around this person. This person is a liar and not to be trusted. This person is a hub. You be dealing with a Sagittarius or a Cancer. There are hoes here. They got no beginning. They're watching you. They hating on you, Capricorn. It's crazy how this reading come out, but they're watching you. They have no new beginnings here. The evil eye is reversed back to these fucking haters, these fucking bitches, these fucking niggas, these motherfuckers with no goals. They sit around you and worry about you. Masculine, feminine energy could be same sex. Look at this. They're gossiping about you, telling lies about you here. I definitely see that this is look like more than one person. And a Sagittarius could be involved in this. This could be somebody that you dealt with that was a hoe here. That was bad news. You feel me? Yeah, I hear somebody is going to get bad news about something as well here. You may find out something here, or so you may find out somebody was bad news. But I'm definitely seeing that you're going to be celebrating with the King of Pentacles in the future. Something is victorious. Your emotions is out, but you got a lid on your emotions. You feel me? You just don't have no time. You're not letting them in or out. And you're victorious over a situation. Somebody was trying to steal your energy as well or do magic on you, but you had your guard up or your guardian angels maybe seven of them here you come up out of a betrayal third party situation you dead a situation here you come up out of being a wounded warrior and taking some type of chance you walked away from something and judgments in your favor capricorn somebody is overthinking something here somebody could be thinking about you somebody in their emotions definitely somebody is mad as fuck here you be dealing with a water sign i definitely see a lot of secrets came out here you've been dealing with a leo but i see you cut some shit off here you come up out of confusion you come up out of anxiety it could be definitely with the Sagittarius here. That came out again. They make sure I got two warm cards in here. Because that's weird. And I know two don't supposed to be in here. No. Mm -mm. Yeah, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius that you was patient with. But it's just like everything is like at a standstill here. You could be dealing with an Earth sign. You come up out of putting yourself in situations. You wasn't having peace here. 
it was unhappiness. You was trying to balance some shit here. Somebody got a lot of legal problems here. A lot of secrets came out. Somebody is just sneaky and trying to blindside somebody in a situation. You could be dealing with a Libra here. Yeah, you started from the bottom. Now you on top. Somebody got a lot of shit on their back because they a devil here. They in devilish energy here. I don't like that energy here. But you cut them off and that's the truth. And somebody who had too many ups and downs with. Wow, what's this? Yeah, and they had a bunch of bullshit with them. You cut them off. That's the truth. You cut them straight off. You come up out of feeling defeated and making a choice. They're unhappy about a situation here. You're not really worrying about money here because you know it's coming here. And you make shit happen here. Somebody could lose a baby here. Some secrets could come out here. I'm seeing somebody is balanced here. You be dealing with a Virgo or somebody not going with them, but you're celebrating. You a boss with the Ten of Pentacles. Look at that. Capricorn, you come up out of thinking about shit you lost. You moved away or you maybe getting some messages. You come up out of feeling like you trapped, can't see. You building shit. You got the whole world in your hands. Nobody could snake you no more. You already know they not to be trusted. They was fake as fuck. You left them out in the cold. And they looking outside and trying to figure out what's going on. You feel me? Because you got that new love, new beginning. Blessed from the divine. You love yourself, divine, and others here. You could be getting married. You got options anyway. And they all going to come visible to you, Capricorn, masculine, feminine energy. You're balanced. And nobody could come towards you at this time. They want to close cycles with you. But you a queen of pentacles. You're like, get the fuck out of here, bitch. Masculine, feminine energy. I ain't closing no cycles with you. I don't want nothing to do with you. There's no cycles to close because I don't want you in my energy. I don't want to hear your voice. I don't want to see your face. I don't want to smell you. I don't want to fucking, fucking even think of you. That's the energy that I'm seeing here. And somebody's definitely trying to close that cycle with my Capricorns because they see us as the queen of pentacles, masculine, feminine energy. And we like, no, we, we already forward. We left that cycle. You still want closure for you. We already back to the pinnacle. We balanced this fuck. No, you can't come to us now. We don't want to hear that shit. We got other options. We love we love us. We love the divine you here. And you left motherfuckers out in the cold. This is masculine feminine energy. Like you like, mm -mm, I got I'm building my shit back up. I got the whole world back in my hands. I'm not letting no snakes back in. You done. You like, I'm done with anxiety. I'm coming up out of having fucking confusion with people. You not like, you was unhappy because other motherfuckers was unbalanced. That's the one now. Mm -mm, no. They had a lot of bullshit with them now. Now they thinking about what they had done here. They was bad news. You feel what I'm saying? They got no new beginning. You feel me? They got painful endings coming. They gonna have money troubles. All they do is gossip, lie, and talk and worry about the next person. Bum ass bitches, boil butt bitches, whore ass bitches, bitches that swore they was wifey back in the day, all that bullshit. Dumb ass niggas that let these just, they just dumb. They don't know how to get money. They talk too much. They thinking they slick, all that. This is what's going on right now, Capricorn. But at the day, you don't give a fuck because you the queen of pentacles. There you want to close cycles and you like get your bum ass, dirty ass, crusty. Monkey looking, gorilla looking, fraud, fake bougie, but broke ass out of here. And this goes to a couple motherfuckers that I resonate this reading with. <laughs> like, stop. Sit down, yo. They mad because, look, you walked away from them. You walked away from them. They mad as fat. Listen. They won't let me talk. They mad as hell because you walked away from them. You turned your back on them. Some of you, you may talk to my child and just walked away. If you're not, you will. You ended some shit. And you kept your emotions intact. you like, I'm not dealing with this shit. Like, no. Because they was unhappy and they was bringing that shit to you. Like, you the nine of cups. You need one more cup. But this way, they had you this way. You had to get rid of them. You realized they was bad news. Like, for real. Like, you may heard they was bad news. They was full of shit. But, you know, you, you wanted to take the chance. You know how we do. Now you left the motherfuckers out in the cold and it's a painful ending for them. They got no new beginning for you. Or with you, I would say. You ended that shit. So we will clear this energy and go straight to some oracles to see what's going on. But straight with my Capricorn so far, yeah, you ended some shit. You know, you can get the fuck out of here. Get your corny ass out of here. <laughs> yeah, they be corny as fuck. I'm like, what are you looking like? Sit your $10 ass down. 
you got like niggas acting like they all that. You wearing my girl socks. Like sit down. <laughs> that is crazy. I look at shit for what it is. I'm ending shit with, with everybody right now. Real shit. Why? Because that's what I need to do in my life. I need to end shit. It's too much. And I just want to be at peace. And the only way I'm doing that is getting back into my hibernation, which is Virgo energy. Go within and do what I do, which is work heavy. That's what I'm doing. If you don't got a strong work ethic, I don't have time for it. I'm chilling. I had my little fun. Like, I don't know what people was thinking. Like, I'm on point. The fuck? I'm not trying to be in a relationship with somebody that ain't got no goals. Or somebody thinking I'm writing them letters. I'm done with all of that shit. And somebody inbox me, so me cash out them a couple of dollars. You better call them niggas on Moore Street you was dealing with. It's my energy. Fuck I look like. I ain't fucking you. I wasn't fucking with you either. But for you, I like to go. I got nothing like that. Nobody could get over on me. Firecracker. Excitement. There could be a lot of excitement going on. I know for me, there is a lot of excitement. Let's see what else come out for my lovely, most hated Capricorn. Mule. Someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change. Yeah, somebody don't want to change. It could be you or somebody else here. I feel this you. You could be dealing with a Taurus. Don't have to be. Somebody got Taurus placement. Goldfish. Increase immaterial wealth or spiritual growth. Yeah. See, once you leave the negative, divine made everything right. Like fucking around with people was fucking up my money. I wasn't fucking up my money, but their energy was fucking up my money. A tower moment. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Solid foundation, success, and effort. So somebody's, it's a tower moment, but this is a good tower moment here. Somebody's having good tower moments. This could be you. You may have to just move forward and just do what you needed to do. So it's bringing good tower moment in you. Because like I said, and I tell people, it's not always bad towers. It's bad and good towers. Sometimes you have a bad tower or a good tower, depending on what you got going on. It's the energy around you. People be crying about that energy. They don't know about no motherfucking energy and talking to your ancestors. And they come in and talk to you and seeing shit. They be lying. Like, I literally see people literally sometimes here. Especially when I call out on them. I can't explain it to you. It's spooky sometimes, but it is what it is. That's what I'm dealing with. People, you could be in a third party situation. Somebody could have you in a third party. It could be some shit going on here, Capricorn. Something is a design, design blessing here. You could have had a big blessing here that people, you coming up out of being backstabbed here. Somebody may backstab you. You may not realize it here. Yeah, the eight spirit guys want to talk to you about some backstab and betrayal here. I don't like that energy here. Yeah, I'm definitely seeing that. I'm seeing some sorrow. Somebody is sorry about something where they will be here, especially if they backstab my Capricorn. Like, you definitely, this could have been a, a twin flame you was fucking with too, a hater here. Somebody you probably cut ties with. You feel me, Capricorn? It's like, I, me personally, I've been cutting males off, not even not no relationship as far as business as well, because they not doing what they, they not being productive or they doing something else and i don't know what they think but my business and leisure and 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 love is two different things business i'm not me i'm somebody else you don't know me you don't know me so when you get to know me when something go wrong with business you don't want to know me no more so you get right i'm not one of them don't look at me as a female with a vagina bottom fucking line not with a kind of money in business so I see somebody could be famous here, or you got a lot of fame, or somebody got fame around you. I definitely see big mad. This could be reverse. Somebody could be coming up out of being big mad, but I feel like you got a lot of big mad people around you. That's because they see you as being famous here. You got a wander wannabe vibe. Somebody could be sniffing coke on the low here. You may not even notice here. Yeah. Somebody definitely sniffing coke here. That's like watching you. That's hating. 
here. Yeah, somebody that's shady here. Somebody's really shady here. And somebody want to cater to your body, but I don't think you want to deal with that. And this is a mama's boy that you could be dealing with here. You feel what I'm saying? Something is going on. I feel like you like, all right, I'm heading out on these motherfuckers. And that's like the energy I do with people. That's the energy that I'm seeing from my Capricorns. You just like, you put your finger up like, uh-uh, I'm done. All right, I'm going to head out of this shit here. I'm out. I'm not dealing with that. That's the energy that I'm getting. Yeah, because I definitely see that somebody want to be you. And oh my God, these bitches want to be me. Like, bitch, you can't be me. Like, I don't want to be you. You bitches can't be me. Y'all bitches fucked the whole hood. Duh. And try to keep it secrets. Half of them turned to another religion because they wore out. The other motherfucking half is just burnt. And then the other half trying to make somebody something that they're not. And they just dogged them out. Like, I heard about everything. I know everything that's going on. I don't give a fuck. Because I didn't get dogged out. I may got ate out, but I didn't get dogged out. Yo, I see somebody maybe getting fired out the blue here. Um, I feel like somebody getting fired because they, you know, maybe was fucking around with another Capricorn or somebody was up to something here. But I'm seeing somebody is getting away. I know that's my energy right now here. And somebody just want to be cuffed up. And scoop. It's a scooping season. And somebody is missing pieces with somebody here. Somebody is a fraud. Yes, they are frauds. This is exactly how they look. Like clowns, frauds. And you're above the rest is why everybody hating on you. You feel what I'm saying? They mad as hell. You don't know this person is a fraud. This person is a wannabe. You could be dealing with somebody that's like a tomboy here that be hating here. You got to watch somebody, but somebody is a fraud. This could be somebody that you think is your A1 day one. I say less because I'm laughing about something that I know, bro. No one, no Lord. But see... I move different than the rest. That's what people don't get. Let's see what else come out. Taking my time because I got meat in there and there's no way to rush. And plus, I want to do a little bit of reading. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my ball says Capricorn? The most hated creative using skills and personal efforts so you may need to use your creative powers in something at this time or be more creative yeah somebody is waiting for something a pending decision and somebody is coming up out of overcoming obstacles and being adapting to something so somebody need to adapt to some type of change here yeah Deception, confusion, loss of control. Somebody definitely is coming up out of this. This could be you. Somebody could have had you losing control. You feel what I'm saying? People will. That's why I stay low because people crazy. They be trying to have you on some other shit because they on some other shit. That ain't got nothing to do with me. I got my own energy. So I just cut everybody quick. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? I need to focus on my healing. So somebody really need to focus on their healing. This could be you or somebody else. Or this is you trying to tell somebody this. Yes, it is too late. Yeah, it's no coming back, Capricorn. Capricorn, this is us because we, we don't do that. I can still see you standing there. So somebody may miss you and still see you here. I hope you're happy. Somebody just hope you're happy or you hope they're happy. I don't know here. I don't resonate with that. I'm chilling. I'm not having no problems. I had a great doctor appointment today. I ain't fucking around. People crazy. I have some things to do. I'm doing what I need to do. I look at shit like people that get so fucked up. I can't even like, like me personally with people, it's a shame. Like that record's so fucked up. You can't even come together with people because I, um, I'm about to deal with kids. I'm starting to understand our connection. That's for somebody. Like somebody wasn't never here to stay. Somebody was just here to teach you a lesson. You feel what I'm saying? Somebody was here and everybody don't get their lessons. You feel me? I love you unconditionally. Somebody could be telling you this or you could be telling somebody that. But yeah, somebody wasn't here to stay. 
period. This could have been you or somebody else. I can't stop thinking about you. You could be thinking about this person. They could be thinking about you. The bottom of the deck. I hope that you can forgive me one day. Like, this person know they did you fucked up. Like, this is the energy I'm getting. But they also know that it's no coming back to you either. You feel what I'm saying? So it's just like, no. And no type of way. Like, you, could, you wouldn't help this person nothing. It's like nothing. There's no nothing. And that's my energy. Like, I don't fuck around. Yeah. Somebody had a painful ending with the Ten of Swords. Somebody could left somebody for dead or somebody could be on that energy take what resonate happy birthday proof of birthday somebody get a three car reading today you gotta email me rcv will it stay broker at gmail.com under every video 2022 is the best year of your life or going to be i would say 2023 2024 is going to be the best year of somebody in life and somebody definitely is hiv positive but it ain't the fuck me crack the fuck up you feel what i'm saying i'm just glad i don't play that they talk too damn much yeah this bitch this gorilla bitch it was a gorilla bitch trying trying to start something but i shut that shit down real immediately because i just had had that checkup. I had to have everything done and I got something going on <laughs> that they mad. Something they can't have, won't have. I don't give a fuck what else they have. <laughs> you feel me? So yeah, they talk too much. They always talk too much. They always was a big liar. You feel me? Like this person was a big liar. Like that's all they, they wake up and just lie. They got a gap in the middle of their teeth because that's all they do is lie. Yo, these bum ass bitches. The energy I'm seeing you telling somebody is like, fuck you, bitch. You gorilla looking bitch. That's my energy. Don't get in that car. So I feel like you should be careful and don't get in somebody's car. He or she really don't love you here. You may be dealing with somebody that's acting like they love you. Yeah. Fame, hate, glory, jealous. People could be jealous of you here. And somebody's definitely sniffing dope. You may not even notice here. They don't like you, but fuck you. I don't like you either, energy. This could be somebody that's smoking cancer, smokes cigarettes here. <laughs> A gorilla that smokes cigarettes. Again, once again, see that clearly. Yeah, I want you to see that. Yeah. Fuck wrong with you. Yeah. With the death card. It's a permanent ending. Make a wish, bitch, because I did. My team is my team, period. Yeah. So somebody really didn't know who you fuck with and they was talking too much to. But at the end of the day, that's on them. Let's jump and see what else is going on. I know people like... That bitch, that bitch, that bitch, that bitch. That's all you can say is that bitch. Ta-da, bitch. Somebody could be spying on you, Capricorn. We used to that all day, every day. Holy Spirit. Two-faced the energy. Yeah, somebody's two-faced it. I, get down, Tinkerbell. Get down. Somebody's two-faced it. I definitely see that here. Yeah, the new you. Yeah, that's what I said. I said, uh-uh. Arrogant Aries. You could be dealing with an Aries that's two-faced it. You telling these bitches, please, masculine, feminine energy. Somebody's bending the truth here. Gossip hoes. Yeah, bum ass hoes. Let's get it on by Marvin Gaye. Yeah. Get down. Get down. Yeah. Somebody mad as fuck. Bitch sit down energy. Holy shit. That's the energy. Broke drug dealer. Yes. Uh-uh. STD issues. Yeah, these hoes be having issues. Don't get mad at me. Maybe I lucked out. <laughs> A plane ticket. Yes. It's already here. I'm about to go on a trip. Near rich experiences. <laughs> Only if these bitches knew. And some of y'all asked for me. Somebody wanted me to look there, look over and try to help them out with court. I ain't doing that. I need thousands. That nice shit is over. Don't play that shit. I ain't doing nothing for nobody. You gotta be my day one, the day ones. Then I got you. And they got them yours. But if they come to me and ask me to look for court papers, or they ask me, can I like look out for them? Or they could they come to my house because something is hot and 
they know I don't have nobody in my house, nobody know where I live, they got that. New motherfucker, I don't give a fuck who you relate to, who you know. You don't get no pass. I don't know you. Yes, it is too late. Once again, this came out. Mm. And I ain't mean to use this deck. It's too late for something. Yeah, that's in my energy. It definitely is too late. I don't want nothing to do with that. I'm good. I'm going to go jump into um, a wisdom oracle and see what comes out. What somebody needs to do. Because I want my Capricorns to know what the fuck's going on. Because these motherfuckers is always on some shit. We can't never get a break. They always on our dick all day long. It's like, damn. Can we can we breathe, bitch? Can we breathe, bitch? Masculine feminine energy. Can we breathe, bitch? I remember one time when my goddaughter was alive and she came out. She's like, oh my God, God, mom. I went in the bathroom behind her and I couldn't believe it. I said, what you mean? She's like, oh my God, it was a smell that had me so sick. I'm like, yo. So I just ready to come back here. Me and her had outs because she was being a little too grown and I wasn't having it. So she had to go where she could be grown at. You feel what I'm saying? That's how my goddaughter got with the gorilla. <laughs> and I don't mean a rapper gorilla. I mean a real life animal gorilla. Well, shit. These bitches on some other shit. Don't be mad if I get what you cutting here, bitch. By the book. I know what this is. 11. Yeah. This is what you need to do. I'm going to warn you. I'm going to warn you. For my Capricorn, you got Capricorn in your chart. Whatever you doing, you need to do it by the book. Do not do anything sideways. Don't do nothing. Um, Sorry, you guys. I got to alert. Um, don't do nothing half-stepping. <laughs> Do everything by the book. I don't give a fuck what it is. It could be you baking a cake. Do everything by the book. Because if you don't, you're going to regret it. With 11, 11, 11. Look up 11, 11 for me. We also have round and round. 25 break down to a 7. 7 is my lucky number. But also 7 represent for me. For round and round will be. Something's keep going around and around and around. And it needs to close. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? Let's see what else is going on. One more before I get the book out for you guys. And then I'm going to go deep. Fork in the road. Yeah, somebody don't know which way to go. And it's crazy because I really don't need the, I don't know. I, I don't need the book. Bottom of the deck, observer. Somebody could be observing you too much or you need to be more observed. You need to be more, observe things more. Take what resonate. Twelve. 13, break down to the four. You need to observe. Somebody's confused about which way to go here. And you just going around and around in circles because you don't know which way to go. And I'm feeling like you should just go with the flow. Go by the book. Whatever book that is that you know. But somebody's definitely watching you here. And you are blessed. You're blessed. You're blessed. You are blessed. So go buy the book, whatever the book is. I don't know what your book is. Your book could be anything. It could be a book you made up. Whatever book you've been living by, go by. It says stay whatever, stay the same. Don't do, don't half step something. I don't know why, but don't half step something because it looks like you won't regret it if you do. It. Don't do it, and that's for me too. I ain't half stepping nothing. Probably in every step I need to do is staying away from bad energies. Bad energies can have you losing a baby, all types of shit. I'm trying to tell you, people be hating. It's time for in the nation. Somebody may be trying to sacrifice you here, Capricorn. Or you may need to sacrifice somebody. I hate to tell you this. But you may need to sacrifice somebody you got to get rid of for your blessings. And I know you like what I mean, sacrifice. I'm going to leave that alone and you just do what you need to do and look it up and figure out what I mean. That's it. But something needs to be sacrificed here.
Capricorns, I got all my spells lit. Bitch, shut up the spell. Shit lined up for everybody. Added more people. I ain't got time for that. Fucking with me. You might got money, but I'm going to fuck with everything else in your life. See, I don't just fuck with people, buddy. That's the thing with my spells. Like, I don't do my shit like that. Like, you people do. Like, people fucked with mine couple of weeks. I know what the fuck's going on. I don't lie and act like something. I'm not like these bitches. But I don't do scams. <laughs> I don't steal people's car numbers. I don't do none of that. I don't do check for I don't do none of that. That's not me. To get by. The fuck? I don't know. They lie to other motherfuckers. I know what the fuck's really going on. But bottom line, we're going to see what's going on with my Capricorn. I got to read. Okay, power. You got to, Wow. And boundaries. I love it. So bottom line here is you got power and you setting boundaries. Period. You feel what I'm saying? You not having it. You not having it. You like, I'm setting boundaries with everybody. And that's the energy I am in. And it's the energy you may need to be in. So we going to jump right to boundaries. And see how did it come up that way? Because sometimes it don't come up that way. All right. So it's going the other way. Go to the point and draw the line. A theme appears as a warning sign. Attention claim now cut those ties. Focus return now you shall rise. The magic the magic is work the magic is work with harm to none, so mote it it be done. Your intentions have been rather hazy up of late. Not are you giving the right signals about who and what you are. In fact, do you actually even know who you are at this very moment? It's time to finally Focus and get to the point. You cannot expect to be taken ser seriously if you have not set your boundaries. For not doing so, you will find that others cross the line by taking advantage of you, not respecting either your space or you. Your natural energy is being drained, drawing your attention unnecessarily to others instead of what is really important. A theme offers to cut ties with those who no longer serve your highest purpose. This doesn't necessarily mean that you will banish these people from your life, only that you won't be taking on their energy demand, energetic demands, which are drawing you away from your true purpose. Mentally ask the power of a thing to cut those, these cords and perfect love and perfect trust and your, and your vitality and focus will return. A theme is also used for the ritual purchase of casting a circle, cutting ties, directing energy, or to cut and reseal a door in a ritual circle. It is one of the four elements magical tools used in traditional witchcraft. It represents the element of fire and is in the mas masculine principle evoking the act of pre-creation in conjunction with the childish. So... That's crazy because I said I was sending boundaries and cutting people the fuck off in my life because I realized it's just like, it's just too much. And me, I'm cutting people completely off and then some is boundaries. You feel me? With the witch's hat, we have power. You feel what I'm saying? Like people say what they want. Yes, I'm a witch. Yes, I do spells. I don't give a fuck what the fuck you talking about. Yo, that shit don't bother me. What the fuck you saying? Yes, I've been doing this since I was 12. Before 12, but my mom was on some shit. I'm grown now, so I could do what I want. Period. You don't like it? You could just, you know, suck a dick. That's what you do. <laughs> you know, that's what you've been doing. Ain't nothing new. So, just continue to do that. Repeats from the past holds you in fear. They keep you back when you are so near. The stress reclaim grows by the hour. Now step back into your self-power. The magic is worth with harm to none. So muted there is done. So with the witch's hat, your power is back here. Or it's coming back, it will be. 
Declaring yourself a witch isn't about dressing up and just looking the part. It runs much deeper than that. A true witch understands where their strengths lie and uses them accordingly and wisely. You have all that it takes to walk the ancient path of the old ways, and yet you allow our, our, mm, you allow others to disempower you. Oh my God, I do. You tend to give in, give in when your words of beliefs are mocked. Past memories of progression are linked to your fears, which cause your light to fade and hide in the shadows. Time to step your foot in def defiance to anything past or present that is stopping you from growing into your wise one you are present, that is stopping you from the wise one you truly are. By standing strong, you are in a state of declaring to the world that you are the wisdom keeper others are waiting to turn to. Now you can wear your witch's hat and stand in your full strength as you step into your optimum power, never to be given away again. So basically, somebody need to step in their power and they are in their power and this is me yes i'm a witch i've been doing all this shit but i don't sit and do this and that to hurt people no i don't i don't i don't but if you hurt me and you did something to me or you constantly kept doing shit to me believe me you and that bitch shut up spell this here yeah right here yeah you're in this bottom fucking line you in this the candles lit yeah you had all types of shit depending what you done to me it depends what you done to me Yes, I may fucked with your vehicle. Yeah, I may fucked with your life, your emotions. You may not now even know that I had anything to do with it. But at the end of the day, what have you done to me? And that's that's it. Other than that, I don't do shit to people. Bottom line, I want to put that out there because people says what they say. Um, bottom line, like I have gift. Yes, I I used to know when my first love, Lavar, used to pop up on him. He used to be like, "How you know I was here? How the fuck you know?" I got strong intuition. Yes, I see shit. Yes, I used to talk to my grandma that passed away. Yes, I talked to my daughter that passed away. Yes, I talked to my son that passed away. Yes, I do. Yes, I talked to my cat that passed away. Yes, I do. Is it crazy? Fuck no. It's just, I got intuition. Like, it just come. I can't explain it. I It don't come with somebody around. It's usually like if I'm asleep, I get up on something or... It just come out or I start sweating or I got to get a car read or I just something come in my mind. It just come. It just talks. That's it. I can't explain it. Like a lot of people, they don't tap into shit. I, I've i been, I, that's how I am. Like, that's it. You are so powerful than you think. More powerful than you think. Enforce your authority. Someone is trying to influence you. Walk away from those who do not serve your highest interest. Reclaim yourself power. Investigate your past lives to heal field of perse um, persecution. The hat is a visual representation of the cone of power, which creates higher wisdom. Used in school as a dunce hat. It was placed on a young witch elects to help them to increase intelligence and connect with God. The witches of the Sumshi from China in 3 BCE were discovered in graves wearing two foot long black conical hats with a flat brim. Bottom fucking line. Boundaries and that power I have. And people be mad as hell. Mm. Hey, part three. I want to add a love reading here for you guys and also an angel answer just to see what's the energy. This is for my love. This is for my signs of Capricorn. Capricorns, I love you guys. You feel what I'm saying? I just need love trying to chill. People be on my dick constantly. Yeah, you could be dealing with three fucking hoes here that's just constantly on your dick here. You could be in a third party situation. Same sex community is relevant here. Take or resonate. Yeah, somebody definitely snaked you here. You could be dealing with a snake. It could be a third party situation. It could be three feminines, three masculines, whatever's here. Somebody is snaking you and they keep coming out here. Holy Spirit. Or somebody's just a snake. Yeah, you could have been dealing with somebody that was arrogant as fuck that you had to cut off here. You got justice in this situation. They can't snake you no more here. Could be a masculine or feminine energy. Don't take the cards for granted. But whatever it is, they can't snake you no more. It doesn't look like they snaked you here. Somebody is not closing the cycle with you here. Yeah, somebody is coming up out of thinking about something they lost here. This could be you here. Yeah, you came through nasty. You just cut a situation off, period, here. 
Yeah, you coming up out of overthinking this situation. You done with this situation. Yeah, you got your ten of cups. So I love it here. So yeah, you at peace now. So yeah, I see that you cut somebody off, a love situation off, and I love it there. Because at the end of the day, it was bullshit. I resonate with that. I don't play that shit. I ain't really cut the person off, but right now, I don't got time for it. That's what I'll say. Uh, give me some dick and tongue is all I want. Like, other than that, I don't want you <laughs> at this time. You are the one that I've been looking for my whole life. Somebody could feel this way about you. You could feel about somebody that way. My Capricorns, please forgive me. True love is hard to find, but I found it with you. Lord universe my heart is yearning for you yeah that's what we have for you right here but i love it you like i ain't dealing with that you cut that shit off me personally in my situation i just want top i just want head like they know what i'm about i just want head period i just want head in this connection <laughs> Real shunner go like damn. She say how oh, it is. Yeah, I just want it. Bottom fuck along. Anything else? I don't want. I want new shit again. I'm just that's how I just been lately jumping right along. <laughs> I ain't fucking around. Lasting love. This could have been a lasting love. Could have been lasting past love, because that's where it fell at. Yeah, loyalty. Somebody may be being loyal to you, or you may was loyal. Love grows. And attraction. So, yeah. I see somebody attracted to you here. I see a new love that could come in and grow, but I feel so like right now, like for my Capricorn, a lot of you, y'all just doing you focusing on the bag. You ain't worried about nothing else right now. Me personally, I don't want no relationship. I just want to have sex for right now. I ain't with nothing else. I ain't mm -mm. <laughs> bottom fucking line. I ain't going to sit here and, and say something else that is not. I'm telling you the truth. I just want to have sex. I don't want nothing else because it's just too much going on for me. And with that person, I just want head. You can't give me head? Well, it's like you did. Cracked up. Fuck up. 